And it's not just national elections. Some local elections are gearing up for Super Tuesday. Two Republicans are competing for District 3's county commission seat. State Representative Margie Wilcox and incumbent Commissioner Jerry Carl. News 5's Emily DeVoe gives you a chance to meet the candidates and shows you why the race is heating up. State Representative Margie Wilcox and incumbent Commissioner Jerry Carl have two very different opinions about what's happening in District 3. I've devoted the last three years 24-7. I've never been uh, called on that I didn't respond to two people and to my job. I'm very proud of that. There's nothing that the current commissioner has championed in the last four years for District 3. I mean, he's been a commissioner, and that's about all that he can say. Wilcox isn't holding back when it comes to what she thinks of her opponent. Just a clip from her radio ad shows that. Well, unlike her opponent, Margie Wilcox was born and raised right here in South Mobile County. I don't know that I'd call it mudslinging. I do know that there's going to be a lot of issues brought forth and a lot of differences between the, the other candidate and myself. But Jerry Carl says he's staying out of it. I don't really want to address all of that negative because mm -hmm. majority of it is very creative imagination. We'll, we'll kind of leave it at that. Wilcox points to her record in Montgomery to fuel her campaign, voting against higher taxes and passing a bill to put cameras on school buses. We do need not only our state representatives that I currently have a relationship with, mm -hmm. but the rest of the county commission, bring them and, you know, show pride in our area. Carl, on the other hand, points to what he's already accomplished as commissioner who focuses on growth. I hope to bring the same thing I've brought for the last three years, which is economic development and, and focusing on better roads and bridges. That's something Wilcox isn't buying. Some of the differences between me and the other candidate is that, you know, I'm not going to take credit for things that were done before me. And even though the election is still five weeks away... Well, when you go negative like that, that's a sign of desperation. We can expect more fireworks in the race for commissioner. County commissioner isn't the only race on the Mar March 1st ballot. Of course, we have all the presidential candidates. Incumbent Bradley Byrne will face Dean Young for the U.S. congressional seat, and Senator Richard Shelby will face four challengers for his seat, including former Marine Jonathan McConnell. There are also several other local elections, and if you want to find out which ones affect you and your district, just visit the Mobile Probate Court website. Live in the newsroom, Emily DeVoe, News 5.